I have a couple of things I want to accomplish this morning, but first of all, I want to draw your attention to the banner hanging high above my head behind me. Um, the attention hasn't been drawn to that, so I just wanted to read it. Gabba Kaplan, nationally awarded for excellence, America's top 50. Is that fantastic? That is great. When you're mentioned enough among the nation's best, in the best country in the world, that absolutely makes you one of America's best, but the world's best high schools, Catholic high schools. Tremendous. Bishop Florence Brandt Brand is in Harrisburg this morning. He's at a meeting that was scheduled a year ago. And he asked that I come and represent him in some words this morning. He's written a letter he asked me to read. Dear Mr. Favero, I am delighted to take the opportunity to express my gratitude and congratulations regarding the Geibel Catholic Junior Senior High Schools being selected by the Cardinal Newman Society as one of America's top 50 high schools. It is the intent of the Cardinal Newman Society through its listing of the nation's top 50 Catholic high schools to use the National Catholic High School Honor Roll as a resource for parents, schools, colleges, and donors, and also to recognize and encourage excellence in Catholic education. The high schools making this biennial list are judged upon the criteria of academic excellence, Catholic identity, and civic education. What a magnificent honor, achievement, and acknowledgement of the hard work and dedication to excellence in Catholic education by you as principal, the Reverend Robert Lubick as chaplain, Geibel Catholic's professional educators and support personnel, our students, parents, and the Geibel Catholic family in its entirety. I understand the theme chosen for this school year at Gabba Catholic Junior Senior High School is to take it higher. Through this theme, you have made it known to the Gabba Catholic community and beyond that you intend to heighten expectations for and further strengthen the Catholic identity and academic rigor of Gabba Catholic. I thank you for your desire to strive for excellence. And it is with great joy that I congratulate Geibel Catholic on this special occasion, occasion and recognition as one of America's top 50 Catholic high schools. With sentiments of esteem and best wishes, I remain sincerely yours in Christ, Lawrence E. Brandt, Bishop of Greensburg. Follow the bishop's words with words from me. As Mrs. Rose mentioned 18 months ago, we did some tweaking to Guyville. We brought Don Favaro in. The tweaking that happened 18 months ago. was that we brought vision. Geibel has always been a wonderful story. It's been a fantastic place many, many years. We're in our 50th. It's always had excellence in families, students, parents, friends, dignitaries, priests, those that were trained, didn't even know yet, they were trained to become priests. And they're with us today. It's had excellence in support staff. When you come into Geibel and you see our secretaries, nice people. Geibel's had excellence in professional staff. 
teachers here incredible. Very few places can you go in the world and come into an educational facility where every single one of your teachers is superb. Then you bring in leadership. That was my job. We brought Dawn in, and along with Dawn came the vision, passion, and energy. That's the future of Guyville. The story that's been here at Guyville is only in chapter one. So many chapters are left to be written. But I can tell you this, the preface in the chapter one are fantastic. And so much lays before us in our future. Let me read you some words. Catholic identity, academic excellence, civic education. That's what the Cardinal Newman Society has judged Geibel on and has found Geibel to be in the top 50 in America. That's no easy feat. That's every minute of every day working as hard as you can with limited hands to make sure that this is the best it can be as an educational environment in Catholic and in Christian education. That doesn't just take all of you here. It takes Conary Catholic to build in. And now that we've welcomed Conary into our building, what a wonderful place. All of that professionalism, that personalized care, the energy from our staff, from our leadership, is a simple transition from Con Area Catholic because it's all there too. Only seven schools in Pennsylvania on this list of the top 50, Pennsylvania had the most Catholic high schools honored but only seven in Pennsylvania. And Gabba Catholic is one. So, you may not know that of all the school systems that we have in our nation, the government, government funds certain school systems, and they do very well. But Catholic schools outperform all of those other systems. This Catholic school outperforms all of the Catholic schools. So this achievement, as I wrote in my comments, it's been no secret here at Geibel that this has been long standing. What a gift for the Cardinal Newman Society to finally say, we recognize it also. And that's a national recognition. So how do we lead? First of all, you lead by what's happening here today. Passion, energy, being kind to each other. God our Father expects kindness. That's in this school, first and foremost. You can't take it out, and it's not something you bring in. It's here. It's in all of us. That makes you a top 50 school in the nation, period. Academics, graduation rates, how many go to college, we're among America's best there. Absolutely. And that's statistics. The Catholic schools outperform all other school systems, and we're at the top of all of those Catholic schools. Not just in this recognition, but in our statistics. I'm a personal witness to the professionalism here, to the caring nature, to the kindness. And I'm honored because of that ability to witness this. When I come into classrooms and I see how great you are with each other, and that you can be fun with each other, and that you can get all the way down to 11 players on a football field, and still fight as hard as you can. That's tremendous. That's what a wonderful Catholic education is. So 
So let me say something about vision. Only those who can see the invisible can do the impossible. That's a quote. I didn't look to see who it's from. It's in my office, sorry. <laughs> I didn't come up with it, but I love it. I've been out this week. My dad passed away on Monday. This is my first function back at work, but I wouldn't miss this for the world. Let me tell you what a Catholic school is like. My kids are in Catholic schools. My son couldn't go to school the next day. The very next day, he went to school. In his religion class, the teacher had prayers and petitions for my son and for his grandfather. And he talked about singing groups and the one he mentioned happened to be my father's favorite. What a coincidence. My friends, that's what Catholic school is all about. I, so I told my mom, that doesn't happen anywhere else. It doesn't happen in a regular school. And this certainly is not a regular school. This is a wonderful Catholic high school. Junior, senior high. So, Mr. Don Favero. Energy, passion, leadership. Thanks, Tom. <laughs> Father Bob Lubick, enthusiastic pastoral leadership and care for, Gaiba, for the Gaiba family. And please add to him Father Willie, who's sitting here. Monsignor McCullough, and if I've missed any of our other priests, please add to that. They love God. Thank you. <laughs> professional teaching staff. Tremendous, positive, professional, personal, caring. Please give them a round of applause. You cannot talk about the staff with rounding out the staff of the support staff, who are also very professional, very caring. They bring the, just they complete the atmosphere of genuineness here. People like Sunshine, Karen, and Chris in the office, please give all, all of our support staff a round of applause. Connery Catholic. I think they were the loudest in the, in the uh, Gator cheer, by the way. So congratulations, okay? But they all, they didn't have to split it per grade. So you guys, I, I think the sophomore class was pretty intense over there. But, uh, see, the sophomores are right in the middle. They're still willing to go out on a limb, to look foolish if they need to, or to do whatever they, whatever they need. They're willing to be loud. Then you start to get into the juniors and the seniors, and they have to be composed. So I understand. But the sophomores, nice job. Okay. I also have to congratulate our dignitaries, our friends and families, because I'll bet none of you knew what they were going to do when that got over to them. But they were pretty good too, so congratulations. Thank you to you all. Everybody sitting here makes this a very special place. Thank you to you all. Round of applause for each of us. I need to read two more things. In my um, quote that I gave for our reflections uh, for the uh, release. I ended with Gabba Catholic is simply top, a top-notch Catholic education setting with inspired, energetic, professional, and caring leadership, teachers, and support staff. And I corrected this out for the papers. I forgot to mention our wonderful chaplain, which I have in the papers. Thank you again, Father Bob. A family in, Fayette, in, the, in the Fayette region 
could not ask for anything more in an educational institution. That is absolutely 100% true. And we need to spread the word because that is a fact. We are simply the best, as it says in the commercial. Finally, the theme that we've had this morning seemed to go right along with my, one of my other favorite quotes, which is, happy are those who dream dreams and, and, are, and are ready to pay the price to make them come true. Thank you for dreaming. Thank you for working so hard to make this come true. It takes everybody sitting here to make us the best. Thank you, everybody.